Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But now let's talk about Cardano ADA. We're going to be discussing what's happening with the price of Cardano and what we could be targeting in the upcoming days ahead of us, especially the upcoming weekend. So if we're looking at the entire market at this point, you guys can pretty much see everything is in green right now, except a handful of coins. Um, reason as to why we're seeing a little bit of a retracement within the market is because Bitcoin is seeing a minor retracement. But nonetheless, you know, the past month, pretty much the past three months have been nothing but great. So if we're looking at ADA on the daily time frame, it's up about 2.1%. And on the monthly time frame, Cardano is still up 62%. And this, as a Cardano holder, you do not want to ignore. And speaking about Cardano holders, I've been reading some of the comments that are coming in, maybe on my Solana update, maybe on my Bonk update. You know, people are saying Solana is not moving. Let me remind you once again, up 63% on the monthly time frame. And on the yearly time frame, it's up 143%. And we're still talking about a project that is completely one of the top big boys in terms of market valuations. I know this can be really discouraging when you are looking at other coins that are absolutely flying, but this should be a reminder, a continuous reminder for yourself um, as to how important diversification really is. It's literally finance 101. Um, you need to diversify your portfolio because you never want to have your eggs in one basket, you know. So, Pretty much now, let's take a look at ADA, see what is happening right now. So if we're looking at Cardano, some interesting things to note. So the price is currently sitting above 61 cents. Um, we're up 2.6% in BTC comparative. Market cap currently sitting at $21.5 billion. And the 24-hour trading volume currently sitting at a billion dollars. So what we have seen is that the trading volume has pretty much doubled in the last 48 hours again something we need to be watching closely at but now let's talk a little bit more about the price but before we do that you guys know as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so it's not a crypto zx ADA video unless we talk about the total value locked the DeFi for ADA. So the DeFi for Cardano is increasing surprisingly. And I know some people might not be seeing this, but it's climbing up slowly but surely. And something I want you guys to be focusing on, this might not just be about Cardano. I know Solana ecosystem is absolutely exploding and I've been quite uh, you know, clear with my overall prediction. And again, it's just my own personal prediction. But before this entire hype that's coming in Solana's ecosystem, I was, you know, projecting that, you know, we're going to see something like that happen. And, you know, now that it's happening, literally, if you're on crypto Twitter, you see every single post at this point is just about Solana or it's DeFi. And the reason as to why I'm sharing this is because, you know, we're seeing a lot of other coins being left behind a lot of attention on solana's ecosystem right now meanwhile there's some other projects that are being slept on as of now and you know when you're seeing that explosion in uh, terms of any asset that's where you want to start thinking okay, you know what i'm obviously making a lot of profit but what else is there something that i need to be looking out for and this is why, of course, diversification is your number one key to follow. Obviously, do your due diligence and research. Number two is always invest what you can afford to lose. And yeah, diversification and patience is your number one key to follow. And ADA, I think, is going to surprise a lot of people. It might not be tomorrow. It might not be today. But it will surprise. And the price was having an exciting time today. You could see this for yourself. As we're looking at it 
on the hourly time frame because that's the best way to kind of look at Cardano's price on the shorter time scale and it's better to understand it that way. You can pretty much see since um, December 9th, I'm sorry, 18th, when we did see the price go down to that 54 cents due to the correlation with BTC, Bitcoin saw that uh, retracement and obviously Cardano is no exception. We did see Cardano going down to that level, creating pretty much a double uh, bottom from the December 13th lows. And then boom, you know, if you picked it up at that rate, um, you are up right now. Let's put that into perspective. You're up about 20%. Um, but obviously we're seeing a retracement. But speaking about the retracement, look where we're being supported by. The previous resistance. As we were breaking out, you guys know this resistance is really, really important for ADA. And now that resistance, of course, has turned into support. And that's where we're currently sitting at as of recording this update. So we saw the price of um, Cardano going as high as 65 cents today. Obviously, it was nowhere near um, its um, yearly high. And of course, we want to see Cardano closing the year in the 78.6 Fibonacci retracement level, which again is only 12% away. Earlier today, that was just a move of about another additional 6% and we would have retested the crucial 78.6 Fibonacci retracement level. And you guys know the significance of this. I've said this to you guys before. My projection is once we do see the price getting into this blue zone, this is where the bear market cycle for ADA officially comes to an end. And we will see something similar to Solana in terms of its price. I'm very confident on that. But, you know, right now, the reason as to why I think we did not manage to break into the 78.6 is because, guys, let's face it, you know, Solana just has so much momentum. It has a lot of uh, eyes on it. And that was basically what was happening. A lot of new money flowing into it. A lot of people, you know, positioning out of their current uh, positions and other altcoins into Sol, uh, thinking they're going to miss out because, guys, we're looking at a project that's up from $20 literally two months back to almost three digits. So we need to keep those factors in mind. But the way ADA is holding really, really nice. And, um, you know, obviously BTC right now is at crucial levels of support. Once again, you know what, what I talked about last uh, week when we were around here on uh, December 11th. And I said, you know, we need to actually stay above this, um, you know, support. If we don't, we will see a downside for BTC and boom, that's what will happen. So it's really important. As I mentioned in my bonk update, if you did watch that, you know, we need to see the price actually holding above this range for, uh, you know, BTC. But I'm really liking the way uh, Cardano is holding. I think um, a lot of people are currently sleeping on it. And I think it's DeFi is something that uh, you might want to be focusing on. But diversification is number one um, that you need to follow. And of course, having patience. Patience is really, really important. But let me know down below what you guys think and which projects on ADA are something that you guys are looking out for. Uh, but other than that, um, you know, subscribe, share the video, follow me on Twitter, link in the description box below, and I'll see you tomorrow. It's been CryptoZX and peace out.